Agriculture Cabinet Secretary Metheka Lintori has assured Kenyans that prices of key food commodities, including maize flour and rice, will come down in February. With escalating food prices and high cost of living due to the removal of food subsidies, Lintori stated that plans are in place to change the current situation that has caused an uproar among Kenyans. Speaking in Mombasa, Linturi said the local production deficit is still huge, thus the government will continue to import maize and rice to sustain the demand in the country. In December of 2022, the Kenyan government waived import duty on maize and rice for a period of six months to ease a shortage of cereals and avert food crisis. Miss, we are going to import the rice. So we are not doing it because we want, but the projections are so bad that if we do not do it, our people will die for lack of food. Yeah? So the mitigation measures that we have in the short term, as we plan ourselves to grow more food in another uh, six months or so, is to bring you maize to get the unga. And I want to commit, by the end of March, by the end of February, the cost of unga will have come down. The cost of rice will have come down. The Agriculture Cabinet Secretary mentioned that the Kenya Kwanzaa government is also banking on food production across the country as a viable solution to change the current scenario. But, uh, we are so keen on uh, uh, agro-processing, value addition and manufacturing. And considering agriculture is the backbone of this uh, uh, country and uh, tea, majani chai, employing a quite a big percentage of our rural population and uh, realizing that there is a need to boost uh, thief prices. Linturi, who was accompanied by officials from the Agriculture Ministry, said the government is in plan to put under agriculture above 1 million acres of public land in the ADC, NYS and prisons land to produce more food for the country. We are going to put under agriculture uh, a very, very big area of land, beyond a million acres of land. And uh, it's uh, a decision that uh, all public land owned by NYS, uh, uh, ANDC, uh, prisons, that land should not lie. Endo. We need to produce more food for our people. And uh, uh, we, we, are, we are in the process of identifying how to do it. And uh, we actually want to do it uh, 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 to fully mechanize that process and discussions are going on, we are ending on well. Linturi's announcement comes days ahead of President William Ruto's meeting with the executive to plan his administration's delivery of the Kenya Kwanzaa Manifesto for the year 2023.